Nicholas Nakamba. That looked promising and then broke down. Shots on here. Jo Welcome to you, to Villa Park, the home of Aston Villa Football Club in Birmingham, big city in the middle of England. Martin Tyler here, along with Alan Smith. Premier League football for you, very shortly. Aston Villa, and they take on Burnley. I love visiting this ground, really been disappointed with the entertainment on offer. Don't think I will be today either. Villa team for this game. Pepe Reina starts in goal. Jack Grealish starts. He was man of the match in his last game. And today it's just the one striker in the side. This is the 
Burnley lineup. So Alan, 4-4-2. Yeah, I think it looks that way, Martin. Yes, it's the conventional shape. It's the one that the manager prefers. Thank you, Villa Park. Enjoy the match. Well, I guess it was your ambition as a boyhood Villa fan to play here at Villa Park. When did that first happen, Alan? Oh, it was in the early 80s for Leicester. Tending to do quite well here. Your family's up in the stand, and it was always a big game for the Brummy, returning to a really old and famous football ground. He's won it back easily. There's the interception. Left the defenders trailing now. Here's a chance. Aston Villa have got the goal here. Well, I thought he'd got enough on it there, Martin. I thought he'd done enough to save it. Well, here's the goal again. Showing his frustrations, the manager. I'm sure he'd love to be out there playing himself, but he can't, and his team are losing now. So the first goal, it's 1-0. Well, it was a foul, but Burnley can play on. They've still got the ball. The advantage applies. That's an easy interception. The pass wasn't really a very thoughtful one. Stop. It's Villa's corner. Let play go, and now it's stopped. Here comes the yellow card. Yeah, you could see the ref had seen it, but he wanted to give the team a chance. When you get a corner, you need to do better than that. And it's a goal kick. Poor delivery. I think there was just too much power on the ball, actually. I mean, the keeper's touch just wasn't enough to keep it out. Alan McAnally is at Molyneux, and news of a goal. It's a goal for Wolverhampton Wanderers. Eight minutes played, 1-0. Thanks, Alan. Barnes! Wonderful technique to volley that in. Well, some players can master that, others struggle, but this lad, well, his, his technique is perfect. Terrific goal. Well, coming in from the right, that was so inviting. Wonderful delivery. Great ball, great goal. Another angle on it here. Great news for the manager because I think he made uh, a couple of changes there and now they're back on level terms. So away we go at one all. Goal for Burnley. Number 10, Ashley Barnes. Bjorn Engels intercepted well. The referee is awarded this free kick. Wood. 
now we'll have a goal kick and here's the replay again well that's a classy finish to volley at home and find the bottom right from that distance superb of the by anticipating the pass and the crossing position is a, a good one thanks to the advantage played by the ref and in goal with no difficulty at all there Pepe Reina McGinn this does look promising He's one on one with the goalkeeper. Oh, it's the post. Tried to win it, but it'll be a throw. Rather oh, careless from Burnley. Wood. Bjorn Engels Anwar El Ghazi McGinn Samata Well here he goes It's good to see a player do this Always oh, been called offside here Good work on the ball from Burnley. Trying to find the opening, which would be so crucial. He's through. He's definitely got his goal touch with him today, hasn't he? The first was a decent one. Here's the second. And still time for more to come. Well, he's doubled up here with his second goal. And he took it in excellent style just like the first one and that's a goal well worth analyzing again nothing the manager can do at the moment his team have lost momentum and they're also losing this match off we go again 2-1 Wood. It's good attacking play this from them. Lennon! Just rushed it a little bit. Could have relaxed a bit more. And he seemed to be off balance when he hit it. Is it going to be one of those days? The manager seems to think so. Look at his expression. What a chance miss that was to go level. Bjorn Engels, Samata, that is a tackle and a half. This could be it. Barnes wasted a real opportunity to level the game. Well, I think his teammates know that was a wonderful chance lost. Gilbert, McGinn, Alan McAnally is at Molyneux and news of a goal. It's a second goal for Wolverhampton Wanderers, 35 minutes please. In the clear in front of goal. Saved well by the goalkeeper. Get out. Get out. 
In goes the corner. It was a promising situation. They could have made more of that. A quick note for your diary. Make a note of this particular date. EA Sports, we've got the presentation of the Premier League fixture. Aston Villa, they'll be facing Norwich City away from home. Yeah, really looking forward to this one. Uh, I think we're going to see some good football. Well, he's read that, hasn't he, and made the interception. Made it look easy, actually. Well, he wants to run at them with the ball. Opportunity here! And the goalkeeper can take charge now. First touch was good, but he's got to work hard to keep the ball. Barnes. Well, he's made sure that that attack came to nothing. Frederic Gilbert. One of the Premier League ever presents from its inception in 1992 until the most awful of seasons, 15-16, and relegation rock bottom. And somebody who has Villa in his heart, Alan, what did you make of it? Well, it's just been a, a tale of woe, hasn't it? It's been a disastrous few years, really. And so sad because it's a big club, as we know, and they should be doing a lot better. He's got some room out there. It's a very good interception. The opposition looking to close him down. Anwar El Ghazi. Frederic Gilbert. Well, that is half time, and we've reached. Team's all set, and we're ready for the start of the second period. Good interception. It'll be a throw. Now target. Can't get past him. Such a good defender. It's a terrible place to give the ball away. It's good play to uh, get a foot in and intercept. So what about Burnley's next game? Yeah, they're playing Everton in the next match. And uh, not much at all to split the two sides for me. It's Matt Target. And Buona Ali Samata. The chance is here. Saved by the keeper. Bjorn Engels. McGinn. Taking on. Real opening now. That was a puff out your cheeks moment and phew, got away with it. Well, this is where managers really earn their money in a losing situation. They've got to make a substitution. Got to get it right, really, to have any chance of getting anything from the match. Well, they look promising there in that wide area, but the defender's done well. Westwood. And it takes a nick off the player, out for a throw. Saw it coming, cut it out, good work. He's got possession back for his team. Ben Mee. Aston Villa have possession again. A real opening for him. 
And the referee blows his whistle. The flag was up for offside. Alan McAnally, news of a goal from Molyneux, over to you. It's a third goal for Wolverhampton Wanderers, 63 minutes played, 3-0. Well, many thanks, Alan McAnally, keeping us up to date as usual. That is a decent tackle. They can be quick on the break now. He might be through. Real chance now. The keeper stops it. There could be a follow-up now. Neatly intercepted. Intercepted well. To finish it off. And they manage to score here. Three of the best. He's made them pay. And that completes a wonderful hat-trick. Well, there is a saying that uh, things come in threes. They've come in threes for him, a hat-trick. Not just three goals, but he's played really well. His overall game has been top class today. Oh, his team haven't been at it. And look at the manager's face. He can't believe what they're giving him out there. Just a reminder, 3-1 it is now for Scorla. Just a quick check on the clock, and there are 20 minutes to go. Ben me. And as we thought, Burnley are going to make a change. It's with Burnley now. He has been booked, remember, another foul. Well, they are behind, so it's time for a change. They've got to try and improve their performance somehow. Let's hear from Alan McAnally about a goal at Molyneux. It's another goal for Wolverhampton Wanderers. 73 minutes played, 4-0. That's Alan McAnally keeping us bang up to date. Yeah, the mighty Villa having lots of the ball so far. Here's the chance, and they've scored. Well, he's only been on the pitch a matter of minutes. I'm not sure he's touched the ball before this, but a vital touch there to score. Well, that back line has been at sixes and sevens virtually from the first kick, and I wouldn't be at all surprised to see them concede even more. I don't think we expected this, such a one-sided affair, but look at the scoreline. A change coming up for Burnley, I think. Now they're looking to get forward from this position. He's one-on-one -on -one with the goalkeeper. Top performance from a top team, and they've emphasised their superiority with the number of goals that they've scored. Well, there is a big difference between these two teams, and that goal has meant it's reflected in the scoreline. I think uh, it's going to be a stroll from here on in because they've got a big cushion, rightly so, well in the lead. One team really on their game today, the other very off-colour. Might have been a, a stoppage there by the referee, but he's given Burnley the advantage. Saw that coming and intercepted. 5-1 here, and that's almost that. But what does this mean for their next game?
Yeah, Aston Villa go up against Norwich City after this. Played with a lot of freedom out here. I'll be really pleased. We are going to see a substitution now. And on the clock, eight more minutes. Westwood. Lowton. Matt Lowton. They read the opponent's mind and got the ball. Opportunity in a wider area. Looking for goal now. It's another one for them. They go further in front and they are full value for this position. Shows if you do the difficult thing in the right areas and it comes off, this is what happens. You get a great goal. Sometimes you see somebody beat a couple of opponents and then it comes to nothing, but this fella made sure he had an end product to that. Wonderful bit of skill. Well, it's a tough game for the team that are trailing. They're out of the contest, really. They're just playing for pride. They're really being torn apart. It's poor work, really. Able to make the interception. Yeah. Referee's had a good look and decided what he's seen from this uh, period of play to add on three minutes. Oh, he's cut that out well, well read. Found good room out here. He's one possession. Trying to get the cross in, well blocked by the defender. Final whistle. What a brilliant performance from this fella. Yeah, one of those matches, Martin, where everything he touched turned to gold. It was an impeccable performance. Wonderful technique to volley that in. Well, some players can master that, others struggle, but this lad, well, he's, he's technique. He's perfect.